Alexander Miles was an African-American inventor and businessman best known for inventing the automatic elevator doors. Alexander Miles was born in Sir Clevel, Ohio. His mother was Mary Pompey and father Michael Miles. He married Candace, J. Dunlap from New York City. Together they had a daughter. In the 19th century, elevators were constructed in a way that required a person to manually open and close its doors. The problem with this model was sometimes people forgot to close the shaft doors. As a result, there were accidents with people falling down the elevator shaft. Miles was concerned when he saw the elevator door was left open when he was riding an elevator with his daughter. In 1887, Alexander Miles received a patent for designing automatic elevator doors. Miles designed a flexible belt attachment to the elevator cage and drums positioned to indicate if the elevator has reached a floor. The belt allowed for automatic opening and closing when the elevator reached the drums on respective floors by means of levers and rollers. Alexander Miles made elevator rides safer and easier. After his invention, Alexander Miles moved his family to Chicago. There he founded the United Brotherhood Insurance Company, which sold life insurance to African Americans who often were denied coverage at the time. The mission of the organization was to eliminate discriminatory practices of insurance companies. Due to Chicago's economic challenges at the time, Alexander Miles relocated his family to Seattle, Washington. Alexander Miles was known to be the wealthiest African American in the Pacific Northwest region by the time of his death in 1918. In 2007, Alexander Miles was inducted into the National Inventor Hall of Fame. Today, the influence of Alexander Miles is still seen in modern designs because the automatic opening and closing of elevator cabbing and shaft doors is now a standard feature worldwide.